Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Minish Cap. I am your host, Melee Wizard. And yeah, I'm gonna presume that I have to act, go this way. And yeah, I know better than to get close to that rupee, because it's not one. Uh, dang it. Wanted to see if that was something. But it is not. Okay. Oh, unfortunately, it, you don't, you really get no, uh, no warning when those things actually explode, do you? Alright, let's see what we got over here. Excuse me, I was in the middle of something. There. So yeah, minecart. Let's have a ride. And what a ride it is. Sweet jumping jellyfish, that was awful. Uh, and, well, your feet. Yep, so yeah. No need to to uh, fast forward through the mine carts. The game does a good enough job doing that on its own. Uh There we go. What do we have here? I have like no iframes at all, do I? Haha. And so we have the means of shrinking ourselves down. But there was another Oh. Never mind. Uh all right, let's see what the inside of this one looks like. Oh, pfft. we don't even get to see. Fair enough. But we do have to be careful. There's really nothing we can do against uh, against these enemies here when we're this small. Oh, jeez. Uh, alright. Go for the health. And is this the map? Yes, it is the map. Good. So, yeah, there's decent sized place. I saw the treasure over here. Let's go ahead and grab that. Get a kinstone piece for our efforts. Y yes. Yes, I, I, I do agree. Yeah, you really gotta move it when are on the uh when on these platforms. Oh dear.
Ooh, lots of money. We'll see what the shells are for in due time. Uh, oh boy. Uh, this is just Get our momentum going in the right direction. Okay. That opens the door, and just push this over to here, and then we can actually get to the tre open the treasure chest, and it's got a key. All right. Was there any other? Nope, there was not. Okay. Nothing in that room anyway. I never did go up. From so oh. Well never mind then. Uh wasn't there a locked door somewhere? Yeah, I think there was and I had to go. I just made this whole loop for no reason. I don't know why I went around back around this way again. There was no reason to. Thankfully, I don't need to do anything aside from that's... And I could just work, come back through here again. Alright, so... I think... Yeah, the locked door was back where the minecart was. There we go. Haha! That changes the, the track layout. So I still can't get to that heart piece. So that's a tad annoying. And I can't do anything about that minecart. At least not right now. Aha! This gets me that heart piece. Thank you. So, okay, so there's two treasure chests up here. There's one. Yeah, it looks like I have to do minecart stuff. Is there an easier way to do to do this? Probably. But... but you know what? The spin attack seems to uh, do a good enough job of at least stunning him. All right, what is this? The cane of Patchy. This mystical rod has the power to flip things over. Use it to charge up energy in holes and then flip on on out of it. Okay. And the game has me make use of it right away. I 
because yeah, we don't want to walk on those spikes. Well, I mean, the game told me that they would, they would do something. And up we go. And oh, there's the blue warp. That's good. And flip over the minecart so that we can make use of it. Is this another key? Yes, it is another key. Uh, okay. Alright, down we go. So where exactly are we right now? There, we're there, okay. Uh, I'll have that there for now. Okay, so I need to be small for this. And just, you know, as you're small, I can't even walk onto the train tracks because, you know, they're too tall for me in this form. I'm not sure if those spike traps would do more damage to me when I'm mini like this. I'd rather not find out the hard way. But it looks like those traps can't see me, but they're about to. And up oh, the the cane doesn't do much do anything to those things. It did stun them for a brief moment, but that's about it. There we go. I saw at least one treasure up. I notice it's actually faster to pull than to push. For what significance that has, I guess. Uh, let's just go ahead and take care of that bat first. Up, up here, get another kidstone piece. Was that our first green one? Yes, that was our first green one. There and then Okay. Yeah, didn't mean to talk to you. There, okay. There's the boss door.
Okay. I was af I was worried whether I would have enough time to to get out of there. So there is treasure here. More kinstones. Ow. Aha! Then I just pop right up into the whirlwind, and away we go. How much more treasure do we have? Three. And that does include the boss key. Aha! More money! So my rupee cap is definitely above 200. It's probably 300. Which is... Rather appropriate... Oh boy. I'm surprised I did not get hurt by that. So I had to get hurt by that instead. Oh. Okay. So I saw there was another treasure chest over here. Aha. Uh -huh. And just head straight up and bosky. Ha! And that opens that up, so that in case we die, we can get right back here real quick. Yeah, I didn't trust that the thing would stay there long enough for me to get by. So I'll just wait one more cycle. There we go. Just confirm. Yep, did get all the treasure. Uh, how many? I just have the one bottle. Uh. Not sure if I'll need to use my bottle for anything else, so I'm not going to put a fairy in it yet. If I get a second one, sure, but for now, no. So what is the boss of this place? Okay, then. Oh, jeez. And that's what happens when Link gets set on fire. He just runs like the Dickens. So. Yep. So just gotta flip his shell and then climb on top of him and just go to town and okay. Just barely had enough space. There we go. Yep. Try to take advantage of these things, drip me dropping hearts. Thank you. Since stuff dropping hearts seems to be less common than it feels like it should be. I 
am amazed that hit. And down you go. And there's our second element. You got the fire element. Flames bring light to darkness and warmth to all. The fire element is the embodiment of that power. Hmm? Oh, okay. More hearts! Always gotta have more hearts. I thought my fibers would catch fire! Ah, uh, but it's over now. I suppose we should go back and speak to Malari. Yes, yes we should. Now I just have to... remember where the mines were again. Uh... Was it... Nope. Not there. Um... Methinks I might have goofed a little bit. Uh... I know it w I know I had to be tiny for the to to do the thing. Which probably means All right, yeah, it was right there. I don't know why I didn't Notice that. Ah! Sword looks a lot better than it once did. Wow, that was fast work, but not so fast that I didn't finish your sword. Here, take a look. I call this blade the White Sword. You got the White Sword. Its beautiful white blade sparkles with light. You can put away your grandfather's sword now. Once you infuse it with the power of the elements, it will become a sacred blade. The Forest Elder no doubt told you this part, but if you want to infuse the sword, you must go to the Elemental Sanctuary. The Sanctuary is a strange realm trapped between two worlds. It is the bridge between the Minish world and the human world. The doorway to the Sanctuary opens only once every hundred years. You'll find that door hidden within Hyrule Castle. Once the blade has been filled with the power of the four elements, you should be able to break the curse on your princess. I know you can do it. After all, you made short work of that human mind. Let me tell you about a shortcut you can use to get down from the mountain. You'll find it right in front of the entrance of the mine you just explored. Just follow that and you'll be down in no time. Okay. I'm, gu I'm guessing it's probably referring to that. Maybe. Ah, yes, it's already working quite well. And I could just climb down from here, I guess. Yep, and we're already at the base. And, oh, yep, we're back at the start of this area. Good.
Okay. I'm gonna presume there's... Nope, nothing. But, I'm sure there is some stuff that we can do. First things first, I want to check in on you again. Just to see if I have the right kinstone for you. No, I do not, unfortunately. Dang it. For reasons that I'm not going to explain now, that is definitely one fusion I want to do sooner rather than later, if I can help it. Uh, that is something. Okay. The money ones I'm not going to worry about. The question mark ones are definitely something I probably should investigate at some point. Aha! I don't- I guess I can't do anything there yet. He thinks I'll have to knock off the, uh, knock the masks off the wall somehow. Don't think I have the means to do that yet, though. Uh, that's money. That's a hard piece. Cool. At least, uh, since I... Since they're marked on the map. At least I don't have to worry about remembering them. Uh... Yeah. Mystery thing. Treasure. Mm. Interesting. Um. Uh, right. I got my. I got a new sword, so I should be able to learn a new trick from you. Ha ha. Yes, please. Now I'll teach you a technique called the Rock Breaker. So pay attention. First, swing your sword to break pots. Actually, that's all there is, young swordsman. Do you understand? Yes. Yes! Haha! -ha, good. If you had said you didn't understand, I would have serious doubts about you. Yes, but one must feel the technique, not just hear about it. That's why I will now possess your body so as to demonstrate the technique. This is the secret of the swift blade possession technique of training. Watch this! Grr! Possession! Uh, whew, now, you, now, you must try it yourself. Break the pots with your sword. That's all. Maybe if I use the right button. There we go. Yes, fine work. Fantastic even. I will now give you this tiger scroll. If you ever forget this technique, you can... If I forget, that I can just slash pots. Okay. It's definitely convenient, so I don't have to be picking them up all the time. Uh, when you learn to run like the wind. Okay, so when I learn dashing. Good. Uh, let's see. You have money. You have a mystery thing. How nice that the three green ones I had were the ones that I needed for this. Okay. And that's money, and that's money, okay. Let's 
So, is there anything... Is this open now? No. I think that was 300, so I still can't afford that right now. Which is unfortunate. that over. Oh, right, that. Nothing I can do there. At least not yet. Still wondering about this. Like, this bookcase is on rails, but I can't do much with it. Anything? And... Oh. Still can't do anything there. This was locked by swimming, yes? Yes, it was. Uh, was there another finish portal here? No. Okay. Okay, then. So, nothing there, but there was a couple things there, though that one on the left I don't think I can get to yet. Because the bridge is out. But I think I am going to end things off here. So, I guess, join me next time when I see what I can possibly accomplish as a mini here in town and go hunt down that elemental shrine in the uh, in Hyrule Castle. See you see how far we can power up our sword even more. So until then this is Melee Wizard and have a nice day. <laughs>